Too bad your monster's effect is only temporary, Yugi. Once this turn is over, Obelisk will have all of his power back. Perhaps, but I've still prevented you from attacking me this turn, Kaiba. Uh, stalling for time is a sign of weakness, Yugi. You're obviously desperate. Now it's my move, so stand back. I play two cards, both face down. That ends my turn. Very well. It's my move. Sorry, Kaiba, but since I'm now holding three cards, Slifer's attack points rise to 3,000! <laughs> but now that your turn is over, Obelisk regains its full strength. So your monster is weaker again. Not quite, Kaiba! Observe my face-down card! Pot of Greed! <sighs> Thanks to the effect of this magic card, I can now draw two more cards from my deck. And you know what that means! Sliper's attack points now rise to 5,000! More than enough to take down your obelisk! And wipe out half your life points, Kaiba! Uh, now, my dragon, attack! Hold on, Yugi! Now I activate! Command Silencer! What is that?! My Command Silencer has deafened your Sky Dragon with its extremely powerful shriek. And since your monster couldn't hear your command, I'm afraid your attack is cancelled out. Nice try, Yugi. Next, I get to draw one card from my deck. Now finish your move so I can end this. My Egyptian God card is still more powerful than yours. That may be the case, but you're forgetting one thing. I have a card face down on the field. He's right. And if that card's what I think it is, it can lower my Slifer's attack points, making it weak enough to... Oh, what should I do? Obelisk is losing his patience, Yugi. So finish your move. All right. I'll place two cards face down on the field and end my turn. Now, feel free to attack me, Kaiba! What's he thinking? He just weakened his monster by 2,000 points! What's wrong, Kaiba? Are you afraid of my two-faced out card? God, what are you saying? Kaiba, to Kaiba has to attack now! It's my move! Hold on, Kaiba! I activate my magic card! Card destruction! Now we must both discard every card in our hand! But that's not all. Next, we must replenish our hands with the same number of cards. Fine. Now what's he doing? He didn't change the number of cards in his hand, so his monster's attack points stay the same. Next, I'll reveal my trap card. Disgraceful charity, go! Now we must redraw the cards we just threw out, giving me a grand total of six cards in my hand. Oh no, this can't be! I think you know what happens now. My Slifer gains 3,000 points for a total of 6,000! Impressive move, Yugi. But you'll have to do better than that to defeat me. Because that little stunt you just pulled with your face down cards helped me out as well. By giving me just the cards I needed to win this duel. Explain! Well, thanks to you, I was able to draw this magic card. First for compensation. It lets me summon two monsters from my hand directly to the field. Observe! I play Sword of Soul! And Blade Knight! You're wasting your time. Those monsters are too weak to survive. Slifer automatically strikes every monster you summon. Now, Slifer, attack! I'm afraid that won't work. I activate Card Guard! No! Yes! Now I can discard two cards from my hand. Which means Card Guard protects them both! I'm not impressed. They're still too weak to be useful. That's what you think! 
Yugi, have you forgotten that Obelisk has a special ability as well? And just as soon as I activate it, you're finished! Just try it! Very well. But you'll regret those words. I sacrifice my two monsters to trigger the special ability of my Egyptian God Card! Are you aware of what happens now? Allow me to explain, you fool. These two sacrifices allow Obelisk to storm the field, dealing 4,000 points of damage to everything in its path. And when I say everything, Yugi, that includes your life points. So prepare to be wiped out. This can't be. Yes, it can. Way to go, Seto. Obelisk the Tormentor, deplete his life points right now! Hold on! My wall of Karibos will protect me! Nothing can stop the wrath of Obelisk! Finally, Yugi lost to me! <laughs> Oh, really? Yugi! But how? What's wrong, Kaiba? Were you expecting me to go somewhere? Don't you know that discarding Karibo from my hand protects my life points? Karibo, I would have lost this duel without you. You mock me! How dare you defy the might of Obelisk with that puny Karibo! This is not over, Yugi. It will be soon enough. I place one card face down on the field, and that ends my turn. Very well. My move. Sorry, Kaiba, but since I've drawn a card, Sniper's attack points increased to 6,000. Sniper, destroy his obelisk! <laughs> Kaiba's life points are gone! Now, end this! Sorry to disappoint you, Yugi. Huh? You triggered my trap card! Power balance! What's that? Kaiba, what's going on? Thanks to my power balance trap, you have to discard half of the cards in your hand! Oh no! I'm afraid so. And since you lose three cards, Slifer's attack points reduced by 3,000! So let's go! I don't have all day! Throw out your three cards! Oh. Very well, Kaiba. As a secondary effect, I get to draw three cards! Hmm. So it looks like my obelisk is stronger than your slifer once again, Yugi! Time to return the favor! Now then, go obelisk! Show Yugi some real power! Hold on, Kaiba! Slifer's not going anywhere! I happen to have a magic card that will turn things around! Now I activate my necromancy card! <sighs> Observe! Kaiba, you may want to keep a close eye on your dual disc. Uh, what's this? Uh, 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 late night! Uh, Sword of Soul! Uh, what's going on? Why are all of my monsters returning to the field? Necromancy restores four monsters from your graveyard, Kaiba, and they each return to the field in defense mode. Yugi! Why would you waste your time giving me more monsters to attack you with? I'm glad that you asked, Kaiba. My card has an unfortunate side effect, too. <sighs> if any of these monsters are destroyed, my necromancy will weaken your remaining beasts by 600 points, Kaiba! <sighs> and since monsters have been played on your side of the field, my sniper's special effect has been triggered! Activate Lightning Blast! What have you done? Since Slifer destroyed your four new monsters, my necromancy magic card weakens your one remaining monster. So Obelisk loses 2,400 attack points. Yugi, I never thought you'd take such a cheap shot at my Egyptian god card. 
The tables have turned once again, and your monster's strength pales in comparison to mine. Sniper! Destroy Obelisk now! Not quite, Yugi! Huh. What have you done, Kaiba? <laughs> Who, me? It has nothing to do with what I've done. It's what you've done by using your Egyptian God card to destroy my Sword of Soul, which allows me to add 1,000 attack points to any monster I choose. And I choose my Obelisk! Thanks to you, I was able to increase Obelisk's attack points. Now Obelisk destroy his Slifer! It's over! Your Egyptian God card is ancient history! What? Your Slifer should have been destroyed! Well, it would have been had I not stopped Obelisk from attacking, Kaiba! What? And I have you to thank for giving me the ability to protect my Egyptian god card from yours! For that task was only possible thanks to a trap card that you played! When you activated your power balance card, I had to place three cards in my graveyard. Including this! Hmm. Recognize it? It's a useful monster card known as Electromagnetic Turtle. And it has quite a unique special ability. When this monster is sent to the graveyard, it leaves a small electrode attached to one of my monsters. In this case, Slifer! And it lets you stop our battle before Slifer was unlucky enough to collide with Obelisk. Well, I see you did your homework, Kaiba. Now I place this card face down. What a jewel! This could take all day! Neither Egyptian God card can be destroyed! All right! This is a whale of a duel! <laughs> this is the duel I've been waiting for. It's the ultimate battle of intellect and power. Every time I duel against Yugi, I'm pushed to my limits and challenged in every possible way. Even though I defeated him in Duelist Kingdom, he's known as the world's greatest duelist. Oh, no! <laughs> but that title belongs to me! And when I win the Battle City Tournament, I'll have it back! It's only a matter of time before Yugi's reputation comes crumbling down at the hands of my Egyptian God card! All right, Yugi! My move! You ready? Now then, you only have one card in your hand. That means Slifer's attack points are 1,000. So let's see you escape now. <laughs> it's time to show the world that I'm superior to you! Go, Obelisk! Annihilate his Slifer with your fist of fate! Guess again! Reveal the magic card! Spell textbook! Now I must discard every card in my hand. And in exchange, I can draw one new card. I can then play the card immediately, but only if I draw a magic card. Now that Slifer's attack points are zero, you'll lose the duel. Obelisk, wipe out his life points! This is it! If I don't draw the right card now, I'll lose to Kaiba and be eliminated from the tournament! Come on, Joey! Guide me! I need your help to save the world! I activate this magic card! What's that? Card of Sanctity! It requires both of us to draw until each one of us is holding six cards! Oh no! That means his Egyptian God card increases in strength! That's right! And now Slifer has 6,000 attack points! You're about to lose this duel, Kaiba! Hold on! I activate my final trap card! Life Shaver! It shaves 2,000 attack points off your Egyptian God card! What's going on? 
Corp holograms aren't supposed to do this! Whoa! 